fight cops when we can just leave them in there. The turn will take care of any evac choppers they send in. I'm just bored, you know, stuck up here. Fifty bucks says I can hit a desk sergeant through a window. No way in hell could you make that shot. Give me a rifle and I'll prove it. You're on. I'll get a couple of... Open. goes another boy wonder lost to another super villain <laughs> if it's any consolation i can't see him matching my incredible work with jason can you scarecrow will probably just pump him full of fear gas and slit his little throat oh what a waste ah well just you and me now eh kiddo the real dynamic duo there, there, try those eyes. Seriously, when are you gonna learn? Every time you let someone come between us, they end up dead or crippled or brainwashed into killing you. Take a hint, old boy. We may have had our differences, but you and me, we're made for each other. Looking for someone. You should know by now that nowhere is safe. The Commissioner was so eager to betray you earlier, when his daughter's life depended on it. And now, I have your Robin, the caged bird. Fascinating that your fears would drive you to lock your closest ally in a prison cell. Now those same fears will make you do as I say. There's a storage depot in Kingston. Go there, alone. Prepare to take off that mask, or your friends will die.
Alfred, I'm going to give myself in to Scarecrow. It's the only way to save Robin and Jim. Consider your decision wisely, sir. There could be no coming back from this. Giving up the cowl, eh, Batsy? Good for you. You save your friends, I get another token toxin. <laughs> Hang on. What if Sackface kills you once he's had his fun? No, I changed my mind. We don't have to go. Caring for friends is overrated, especially yours. They can't be left alone for five minutes without being kidnapped. He wasn't safe. And he is now? He'd take a bullet for you, Bruce. We all would. But you left him. Defenseless. You didn't even give him a choice. I'm sorry, Bruce, but you have to get him back. Whatever it takes. So it's decision time, Bats. Give yourself up to Scarecrow and get us both killed? Or is it time for the new dynamic duo to hit the streets? <laughs> Search the area. Find him. 
poison. Pollen, not to mention the bat driving around in his personal war machine all night. Next time there's an evacuation, I'm getting on the bus. Three watchtowers remaining. They'll be waiting. The Knight really hated you, Batman. That's why he failed. These things should never be burned. So. Alfred, I'm going to give myself in to Scarecrow. It's the only way to save Robin and Jim. Consider your decision wisely, sir. There could be no coming back from this. You and me, we're gonna talk about Riddler. Yeah, yeah, sure, whatever you say. You're too kind. Well, it's been a hell of a Halloween. Can't wait till next year. Why well, are you crazy? You give up and we're done, both of us. There's no coming back. Why give up? There's so much more fun to be had out there. Think about it. All those heads to smash. All those Your fears got the better of you, I see. How fitting that I will win and that man's life will be over. Not because of what I have done to your precious city, but because you are scared of what I will do to your friends, your family. They are your weakness. Hiding just below the surface. I'm sure that you're scared of what will happen when I tear that mask from your face. What will we find? Your true identity, or proof that without your mask, you are nothing. Impotent, powerless, afraid. Leave your equipment on that table, and we can find out. Mr. Bruce, can you hear me? I'm detecting someone tracking your movement through the city. I knew he would. I think I may have missed something, sir. Who are you talking? The die is cast, Batman. And from now on, I need your undivided attention. The nightmare is almost over. Your failure almost complete. I can see it. And soon the whole world will your eyes betray you. You
such a happy couple. Shame about the kid, though. Poor little Brucey never quite got over it, now did he? Well, there's no point crying over spilled blood. <laughs> it's time to move on, kiddo. Let go. Take a load off. Join your parents. Uncle Jay will take it from here. So you finally lost it, eh? Finally snapped. My neck. <laughs> No denying it this time. You've got the mind of a killer. And that mind is mine. It's over, Bruce. You crossed the blood red line. And now Scarecrow's going to set me free. 